Hi, my name is John Gimmons and today we're going to correct a bilateral sacrum that is counter -nutated. And if a patient has a flat back, it might not be the lumbar that's the problem, as in flex. It might well be that the sacrum has posteriorly counter -nutated. So to help try and correct that, what we're going to do is we need to find the sacral base. So place the heel of the hand, be careful where the fingers contact, place the heel onto the sacral base and then what we're going to do is I'm going to slowly extend my patient until I feel a bind and then I'm going to ask him to flex forward, so bend your trunk forward so she is flexing for 10 seconds. After 10 seconds, take a breath in please, and as I breathe in and breathe out, on the out phase I keep contact with the base and then I'm going to slowly extend as I'm trying to nutate the sacrum forwards. And hold after a few seconds and then come forward. After 10 seconds, relax, take a breath. And on the out breath, I'm going to try to extend, which is naturally forcing the sacrum to go into nutation. And then we could repeat that three or even four times. Once we've done that technique, we bring it back to the neutral. And hopefully, you might find there is an appearance of a lordosis. And that would be how to correct a sacrum that is bilaterally counter -nutated.